represent unpaired image-to-image -image translation using cycle-consistent adversarial networks. At CBPR, we formulated the image-to-image -image translation problem and presented the PIX-to-PIX -PIX framework. The idea is to translate an image in one domain into another, such as grayscale to color, and famously, sketches to cats. This method uses combination of supervised regression and an adversarial loss to ensure that the result is realistic. However, it requires lots of paired training data, such as edges and cats. But what if you don't have access to the corresponding pairs? For example, you want to translate horses to zebras. In this paper, we learn an image translation even when we don't have correspondences. In such cases, given an input horse, all we know is that the output should look like a zebra. We can do this using an adversarial loss on the output. But is this enough? Unfortunately, we observe the translator network often ignores the input image completely and keeps generating the same zebra from the target set. We need another constraint. Here, we propose to use the cycle consistency constraint in a sense that if we translate a sentence from English to French and then translate it back from French to English, we should get the same uh, original sentence as famously noted by Mark Twain. The same story here. If we translate a horse to a zebra and then translate it back, we should get the same horse we started with. Here's how we implement it. Given an input image X, we first apply mapping G to translate into domain Y. Then we apply inverse mapping F to reconstruct the input image X. We simultaneously optimize G and F to minimize the reconstruction error. We do the same thing in the opposite direction. So let's look at some results. Um, of course, we have the best numbers, but it's more fun to look at some zebras. A hill cycle gun learns to transform a horse uh, into a zebra, or an orange, or uh, into an apple. We can also apply cycle gun to style transfer. Unlike previous single image style transfer algorithm, we learned the style from the entire set of the art paintings. We're also the first to do the offset mapping, going from a painting to a photo. We can apply cycle gun on video frames turning a day into night or everyday stretch into a video game. Even our videos are quite entertaining. <laughs> we release both Torch and PyTorch code and we find more than 20 implementations by other developers. So people have already used Cyclegen in a variety of applications such as translating MI images into CT scans a number of creative extensions and improvements has already appeared on the archive. But my favorite uh, is the result I recently saw on Twitter. So as a cat lover, my dream is to transform every dog picture into a cat picture. But if you like dogs, uh, don't worry. We have cat dog translation as well, uh, just for you. Thanks for attention. I'll come to our post session uh, for a chance to become a zebra.